neighbors gathered to celebrate the retirement of two McDonald's franchise owners. Bill and Pat Desher are retiring after 43 years in the business. Leslie Rojas brings us along for the celebration. Nothing but good times. That's how Bill and Pat Desher describe their journey as owners of 18 McDonald's franchises on the Mississippi coast. My husband always wanted to own a restaurant, and so when we started looking at them, our neighbors owned McDonald's in East Texas when he worked for a company there. And so we went over and talked to them, and they said, well, yeah, we can maybe help you. Little did we know then, they'd only been in for less than a year. With big dreams and aspirations, the Deshers opened up their first McDonald's restaurant in Goshen, Mississippi, a memory Bill and Pat's sons, Greg and Jeff, will never forget. We were little kids. We were little kids. We mowed the grass, unloaded the trucks, things like that. All of them, we were probably, I was in third grade when we moved here, and so Jeff was five, five years old. Yeah. yeah. One restaurant turned into several over the years, allowing Bill and Pat to invest in the community and, of course, their staff. Watching the young people grow up and some of them will come back to you and tell you what transpired in their life and so on. A number of these people I haven't seen in a while. Yeah. Okay, and It's really nice to, to know that you had a good effect on people. And, you know, we pay their college tuition if they're managers for us at community college, or most of it anyway. And um, we've had so many people stay with us just because of that. After 43 years in the business, Bill and Pat are now retiring and handing over the rest of their throne to their two sons. It's a great feeling. It makes you proud. They, uh, they spend a lot of time in the communities and the schools and all kinds of different civic organizations and, and giving back. And that's part of McDonald's. You know, it's a big company, but it's locally owned and operated. So the operators are very involved in the community. And it makes you proud to see people that appreciated that over the years. Bill and Pat were surprised by Gaucher High School Band and Mayor Casey Vaughn, who had a proclamation and gave them the key to the city. In Gaucher, Leslie Rojas, WLOX News Now. Bill and Pat say it's been a fun time providing many people on the coast with their very first job and training them to move on, grow and evolve.